If you enjoy perusing and purchasing antiques, you'll love the upcoming 54th Annual Christ Church Antique Show and Sale. Silver, jewelry, china, art, furniture, and more are just part of the three-day event. Here to share details is Sandra Anderson. Thanks for being here. Thanks. Glad to be here. 54 years. That's a pretty good uh, little, little run We there. have a great track record. We have uh, a lot of the dealers love to come back every year. We have a few ones, few new ones every year. Our, uh, the customers uh, really support this show, and that's why we've been so successful for 54 years. Great. Well, what can uh, people who may not have attended, or like you say, it changes a little bit each year, what can our, um, our viewers expect to find when they go there? Well, we've been told it's the best show in Northwest Florida and South Alabama, and you can find something for everyone, really. As you mentioned, we will have furniture, uh, linens. We have a new linen dealer that just came last year from Kentucky, brought some beautiful things, things that I, I purchased from her. Uh, we have, we'll have glassware, costume jewelry, uh, fine jewelry as well, perfect for a Valentine's gift. Uh, also, we'll have art, china, silver, to include things anywhere from flatware to hollowware to charms, uh, baby rattles, the baby cups, uh, our sil biggest sil silver dealers from Deland and Javine Silver. He brings wonderful things. He can also locate things for you. Uh, there will be brass, Native American artifacts. We have one dealer that always comes with some interesting things from the Southwest. Antique toys, prints, books, clocks, lamps. Um, even one dealer who's been with us just now two years from Greer, South Carolina, brings wooden boxes from England. She's a direct sources and they ship to her. She rejuvenates them and she might bring 70 boxes. Some are, were used for sewing, some were used for carrying your necessities, say your cosmetics mm -hmm. back in the 17 and 1800s. Very affordable if you compare uh, prices uh, on eBay mm -hmm. or other uh, fine antique outlets. Mm -hmm. uh, her prices are unbelievable. Well, you mentioned some of these locations that the vendors are from, and of course, obviously, the categories, which is a huge list. Um, where do most of your vendors come from, and how do you find them? Well, some have been with us for quite a long time. Uh, we locate a lot of our dealers originally through the uh, Scott's Antique Market outside Atlanta, or from different travels that some of our women have been on, you know, to see relatives in maybe South Carolina, Georgia, uh, Mississippi. We have dealers always asking, you know, to get included in the show, but we only have so much room. Mm -hmm. So Tell we, us about some of the, the new people for this year, if you don't mind. Well, I mentioned the linen dealer. It's Chelsea Antiques from Adairville, Kentucky. It's a mother-daughter uh, duo, and they bring lovely things. This year, they're gonna have twice the space that they did last year, so I'm really excited about that. Um, also, we hope to have um, William Cahill from Rome, Georgia with Antique Maps. Uh, we've had a space that opened up at the last minute and we've been in conversation with him mm -hmm. and hope to um, have him join us as well. So that's something that, you know, perfect for men. They're, well, I love maps too, but men especially love to see the nautical charts, uh, mm -hmm. old maps, those types of things are perfect for Father's Day gifts, you know, and when Father's Day rolls around, you're You've always sorry it. you haven't done something. <laughs> so this is, you know, only once a year that we do this. So you, you can go to the mall any weekend of the year and you can go putzing around, but this is going to be the weekend to come. Well, let's, uh, let's just jump right in there and tell them when and where. Okay. Uh, then we'll get back into some of the items and stuff. But, um, tell us the dates and where it will be located and a little bit about that information. It's the first weekend in February always the first weekend in February, so you can remember it that way, uh, which this year it's February 4th, 5th, and 6th. That's uh, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday is the show with a preview party on Thursday night, February 3rd. Um, it's located at Christ Episcopal Church, downtown Pensacola, the corner of Wright Street and Palafox, 14 West Wright Street if you want to enter it into your GPS. Um, so is it, tell us about, about the pricing. I know there's the shopping pass, but then you've mm -hmm. also got the preview party, and I believe there's some, some lunch opportunities, dessert opportunities. Explain how right. all, all that works, if you Okay, well, the preview party to start with is uh, chaired by Adeline Lovelace and Joan Bullock this year. They chose our theme for the year, which is uh, a patriotic one. God Bless America is the theme for the preview, and they are going to the 50 states looking for inspiration for the food. We'll have... Uh, bourbon, Kentucky bourbon uh, meatballs, which is a, a unique recipe that Ethlyn Caldwell is uh, putting together. She's in charge of the, the meatballs. 
we'll have crab and some recipes to feature our Gulf Coast. There'll be Southwest bruschetta. There will be a Virginia ham and cheese rolls. Different things that different states um, you know, are known mm -hmm. for. And those will be the, on the menu for the preview party, which starts at 5.30 on Thursday night, February 3rd. Uh, you can come directly from work, you know, or once your spouse gets home from work and leave the kids with uh, grandma and come down to the antique show. It's just $15 to get in and we'll have wine and uh, also some other soft drinks available as well as these hors d'oeuvres will be passed while you can peruse uh, the antiques. You mm -hmm. can buy at the preview night and okay. that seems to be more popular the last few years um, that people will put a hold on something, you know, right. that night. And okay. It's a good well, we way. put some information on the screen as well about about the luncheon and that kind of thing. And it's five dollars for the pass for shop to shop for three That's days. Right. Is that correct? That's right. Okay. That's the ticket to the show. Well, I know you got to brought a couple of items with you. I think we've got some linens here. Right. Um, this is something I bought from Chelsea Antiques last year. A pair of um, linen uh, hand towels that mm -hmm. would go in your bath. I just love them for the fine work. And you can't find this type of thing. Um, you know, at local local places, local mm -hmm. resources. This is very, very fine. The, I think I paid $24 a towel, and sometimes you can't even order a new monogram towel for less than 30 or 40 through mm -hmm. a catalog. So I felt mm -hmm. like this was quite a, uh, a bargain and just beautiful work that I can enjoy in my, my bathroom at home. Okay, and we've got a couple of pieces of jewelry here real quick. Yeah. We'll take a look at it. Again, this is just a, a sample of some things that, that you've purchased. Right. This piece uh, is a crystal. It looks, it's a lot of blitz and bling. Uh, I guess bling is popular these days. That big chunky crystal, I loved it. I had the chain, but bought the pendant uh, for less than $50 at the antique show a few years ago. It looks beautiful on black. I'd love to wear. Great. Well, in addition to getting some, some good deals on some unique items mm -hmm. in the area, um, I know there's also a charitable component to this because Absolutely. we've been very fortunate to be yeah. involved on that. And tell us a little bit about the proceeds. Well, the women at Christ Church love the organizations that serve our community. So much so it's hard to, to limit our focus. We have many uh, charities such as Council on Aging, Alzheimer's Family Services, Appetite for Life, Covenant Hospice, Favor House, Bridges to Circles, which helps to move people from mm -hmm. poverty through the, uh, the Catholic uh, organization, Camp Happy Sands, Big Brothers Big Sisters, Pace Center for Girls, which does remarkable right. work with young women, mm -hmm. Milk and Honey Outreach for after school programs for children whose parents are not at home when they get home from school, uh, mm -hmm. the Salvation Army, United Ministries, Waterfront Mission, Mm -hmm. ARC Gateway, Loaves and Fishes. And the um, list goes on and yeah, on. That's well, about it. Before we run out of time, please remind everybody um, when and where and how they can get more information, a phone number okay. or website. The first weekend in February, uh, the preview on the 3rd of February, the show dates are the 4th, 5th, and 6th, 10 to 5 on Thursday and Friday, 12 to 4 on Sunday. Lunch will be served uh, on Friday and Saturday from 11.30 to 1.30, hot from the Christchurch kitchen with Beautiful desserts. Our women are known for their desserts. Uh, anywhere from our uh, coconut custard pie, Carol Goldsboro, strawberry tart, pound cakes and carrot cakes from right. Eleanor Curry. What phone number can they call for more information? 432-5115. Great. Thank you very much, and we look forward to it. And thank you for uh, including us in your proceedings. Thanks, Jeff.